Dwayne, I know it's not official, I suppose, yet with the with the league, but you know, Rod Terrence has tweeted out his goodbyes and wishing all the best. But uh, your impression of you know the addition and and I, I can't the... comment, Eric. I can't comment until everything's official. I can't comment uh, on it when it is. That's I'll, I'll comment on it. I'm not trying, you know, until it's it goes through. I, unless you're gonna pay my fine, you are gonna pay my fine. I got a couple bucks. Okay, but all right, okay. Rest, no, no. <laughs> but no, I, I can't comment until it officially goes through. The other day you suggested that Pat might be very close. Is he getting closer to go time tomorrow? Uh, you know, Pat's been cleared to go. Uh, he's still not 100%, but he's been medically cleared. Um, so it's it's on, it's up to him. It's you know he's got to feel his body, and uh, you know he's got to you know I guess he feels 100% uh, to go. Um, so you know that's that's where it is right now. And I understand the sense of urgency with games and losses are counting, counting up, but you also have a week off after tomorrow, and that might right. be as beneficial. Well, we'll see. Uh, you know, we still got two important games. Yeah. Every game, Doug, for us is important. Uh, every possession, we've got to treat it like it's a playoff game, time score situation on our shot selections, uh, everything. Who it plays, minutes, you know, making sure we take advantage of the minutes. So, uh, you know, again, we need all, all hands on deck. This opponent tonight, I mean, historically they've always given you grief. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter to see who's in the lineup, whether who's healthy or who's not. I don't know what it is uh, about this team that gives us fits, matchups. Uh, doesn't matter who's coaching, who's playing, who's where it is. Uh, but again, we've got to come in with our hard hats on, playing with a purpose, playing with a sense of urgency. Um, you know, a pissed off mentality, and uh, all those things above uh, to 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 get the taste out of our mouth of what we're going through. You know, at some point we got to say, okay, enough, mm -hmm. and uh, you know, make sure we execute at certain parts of the game, shot selection, getting defensive stops in the fourth quarter. Uh, all those things are are what we got to get back to and and get back to our identity. We were doing it uh, early in the year for whatever reason. Now it's not just our Offense. Everybody's putting a lens on our offense execution down the stretch. It's getting defensive stops, you know, transition defense, uh, uh, defensive rebounds. All those things go into uh, some of our problems in the fourth quarter. Not to not to get specifically into any trade, but a trade in general or a move in general to a team. Can it be an attention getter? Can it get? Uh, can it? Can it refocus? Well, we'll there? see. It should be. I mean, it should. You know, it's a business uh, for all of us. I mean, it's it's a you know. So whatever trade happens, it, it's a business. Uh, for both sides, and uh, you know, it, 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 if it, but if that it takes that to motivate us, we're in trouble. <laughs> if you have to mo be motivated because of a trade or a coach yelling and screaming at you to play hard, well, we're in trouble. And uh, that's one thing you can't coach is is is, is work ethic, and uh, that's something I know Masai has done a good job of bringing guys in that are quick starters, that you don't have to say giddy up to, and that's important in this league because this is a sense of urgency league that we're playing in. Dwayne, for three quarters in the last game, you guys, the defense that you worked on prior for the first few days before that game seemed to show results. The fourth quarter, it went away. How do you get that extra 12 minutes or so out of the guy? I tell you what, that's that's the huge question hanging over this whole team is let's do it for the fourth quarter. Last year, again, we were number one of the top defensive teams in the fourth quarter. Now, why? Uh, you know, we'll, we got to find out. And, you know, we have some understanding. One is rebounding. One is, you know, making sure we're where we're supposed to be, our base goes, keeping the paint tight, uh, in transition defense, all those things together. You know, maybe one here, one there, one there. Um, you know, uh, add up in the fourth quarter, especially if you're going into it with the lead. You can't relax just because you have a lead. Every possession, defensively, every offensive possession, time score situation, what may be a good shot in the first quarter may not be a good shot in the fourth quarter, and we we've got to get we've got to get back to that, and we've done that and so it's nothing new if, if on the odd chance something happens that opens up more playing time for norm what would you expect from him to be who he is, to be a defender, and that's for all of our guys. Whoever plays has got to go in and defend their position. Uh, offensively, do what they do. If they're a screener, screen and roll. If you're a shooter, shoot the basketball. So whoever it is that goes in there, um, you know, it, it's just not one guy. It's, it's all, all guys tied together um, in, in whatever whatever time they're in the game. We've looked for him for, for to him for more consistency, consistency of effort, be ready to go right out off the bat 
Is that a learned skill for a young players? Well, you know, as a coaching staff, we put him in a tough situation. You know, he starts one game, uh, he has a rhythm, he comes off the bench in the fourth quarter when we need him. Uh, it's a different rhythm, uh, and that's hard to do. So that's tough on him. But again, like I mentioned to the players, this is the NBA. You have a chance to do your job. If it's two minutes, five minutes, the whole game, you are going and do your job and do your position. And don't forget what got you here, the dirty work, the grind work. Uh, so, you know, whether it's Norm or whoever else is in that role, has to remember uh, that I got here by being a grinder, by being a tough defender in my position, and offensively do, do what comes natural.